You're going first this time. <laughs> You're the normal one. Is this all new or? No. Yeah. What'd you say? I'm not president or vice president or anything, but it doesn't mean you can let me down, okay? So at least read mine too for now. Bring this up. But there's been something I've been worried about. Yuri has been acting kind of strange lately. You've only been here for a few days, so you may not know what I mean. But she's not normally like this. She's always been quiet and polite and attentive. Things like that. Okay, this is really embarrassing, but I'm forcing myself to suck it up. The truth is... I'm really worried about her, but if I try talking to her, she'll just get mad at me again. I don't know what to do. I think you're the only person that she'll listen to. I don't know why, but please try to do something. Maybe you can convince her to talk to a therapist. I've always wanted to try being better friends with Yuri, and it really hurts me to see this is happening. I know I'm going to hate myself later for admitting that, but right now, I don't care. I just feel so helpless. So please, see if you can do something to help. I don't want anything bad to happen to her. I'll make you cupcakes if I have to. Just please try to do something. As for Monica, I don't know why, but she's been really dismissive about this. It's like she just wants us to ignore it. So I'm mad at her right now, and that's why I'm coming to you about this. Don't let her know I wrote this. Just pretend like I gave you a really good poem, okay? I'm counting on you. Thanks for reading. Literally, I know. Uh, uh. I changed my mind. I changed my mind. Oh shit! Her face disappeared. <laughs> you just saw that. Ignore everything you just Ignore everything read. You just read. There's no point in trying to do no anything. Point in trying to do anything. It's Yuri's own fault that she's so unlikable. Oh, come on, you're my last hope. <laughs> it's Yuri's own fault. Oh shit. Can you hear me, Grizzly McBee? If you would just spend more time with Monica, all these problems would go away. Uh. Yuri and I are too messed up for someone as wonderful as you. Okay. Just think of Monica from now on. Just Monica. Just Monica. Just Monica. Fuck you, demon bitch. Just Monica. Just Monica. They're all demons now. Just Monica. Just Monica. Are you fucking <laughs> kidding me? Are you Hold fucking on. kidding me? Hold on, it me? says just Monica. Okay. What in the fuck? It's just Monica. Don't say I didn't warn you. Is the Don't say I didn't warn you. Really, bitch? What? Finally! <laughs> I love it's everything it's about it. Kirsley McBee, I want to take this home. Will you let me keep it, please? <laughs> You're too sure nice, Kirsley yeah. McBee. Not like I could type it myself. I could die. 
No, no, not really, but... I'm gonna take this home with me and keep it in my room. I'll take good care of it. I'll even touch myself while I read it over and over. I'll give myself paper cuts so your skin oils enter my bloodstream. What the fuck? <laughs> You can have my poem, too. Besides, after you read it, I know you're going to want to keep it. Here, take it. I can't wait any longer. Hurry, read it. Is that a pea stain? That might be a pea stain and blood. Can you read any of this? Bag. They're, they're bag. <laughs> <laughs> Scroll down. See if there's anything else. Wait, the pea stain. It... The pea stain is moving with it. Yeah. It sells the blood. Hey. Do you oh. like it? I wrote it for you. In case you couldn't tell, the poem is about this and you and me and over and zero. Dracula. Dracula. Nazi Dracula. More importantly, I endowed it with my scent. See? Aren't I the most thoughtful person in the club? I think, I think I'm going to vomit. Yes or no? I don't have to answer this. <laughs> I don't know what. I don't have What's to answer this. What's the question? This. Yes vomit? No vomit? Things I like about Papa. I like when Papa comes home early. <laughs> Like when Papa cooks me dinner, like when Papa gives me allowance, like when Papa spends time with me, asks me about my friends, asks me about anything, gives me lunch money, comes home from, comes home before sundown, cooks, gives me privacy, doesn't tell me how to dress, doesn't comment on my favorite, on my friends, on my hobbies, comes home without waking me up, keeps food in the house. Uses his inside voice, leaves my stuff alone, accidentally drops coins in the couch. Is too tired to notice me. Is too tired for anything. Is too tired for anything. That's about how this fucking game is making me. <laughs> too tired for anything. <laughs>